Yeah, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Card Effect here with a tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to be using um, MPC Studio with Pro Tools 12.7. So first, what I did, I put uh, the MPC Studio on a plugin as a plugin on the instrument track. So that's going to open up. I loaded my track. Now, when I go to the the mix window, what I did is I assigned each output of the MPC Studio to match it up with the input on my mix window in Pro Tools. So, three and four have my kick, uh, five and six snare, and as I, as you can see, the um. The levels are corresponding with each other, so kick, snare, sample, sample, hi-hat, and then I have another bottom snare that's coming into the MP, uh, to Pro Tools. So what I'm going to do is press play. You won't hear no recording because I didn't uh, record enable the tracks, but uh, you can see the levels. So I'm going to just press my space bar. So see, basically this is very good because you're routing all your sounds to separate tracks. You can mi uh, when you're mixing, panning, EQing, compressing, whatever you want to do, every channel is independent. So one pass, I can do one take. Um, just gonna get that going. Just record, enable these tracks, and this is just like a simple four-bar loop, sample type track. I think it's a uh, Jodeci. But check it out. So right now I have the raw audio files, There's no latency, um, I believe this session I set it up 24, um, I believe it's 44.1, a 24-bit, I don't think I did 32-bit float, but um, yeah, anything that goes in goes out, and from my MPC studio, everything that's coming out there is directly going back into Pro Tools but um, and now what I can do since I got it on the grid I can um, you know edit you know whatever I want to do if I wanna you know slice something up or take this part delete that part if I wanted to you know duplicate this you know, and then stretch that out. So the possibilities with this is endless. Um, this doesn't only work with Pro Tools. Uh, I believe in other different DAWs you can do the same thing. It might be a little rework. I've tried this in Logic. I've tried it um, right now in Pro Tools. Um, I'm not sure for different other DAWs, but the same workflow should be the same. I know uh, also I forgot Machine. Um, you can also do this too. But yeah, that's it, man. Uh, a lot of people have seen the way that they their workflow, this is going to increase their workflow. Uh, editing in the MPC Studio, you know, it's pretty cool. But um, my choice of door is actually uh, Pro Tools, but I can use either or. But this just gives me more flexibility with my sound. You know, so, um, yeah, uh, once again, this is uh, MPC Studio with um, Pro Tools 12. And, uh, yeah, you know, you guys can try it yourself. Once again, this is Card Effect. Uh, you can subscribe, uh, leave a comment if you have any questions.
below. And um, keep being creative.